hi guys welcome back again to my youtube channel it is oyine here if you're new you're highly welcome on this channel we'll discuss everything skincare self-care and the general world of the feminine body and if that sounds like you're interested in i hope you subscribe anyways by the title of this video i'm going to be sharing you guys my experience with fungal nail fungal infection this one is a very very emotional and personal one for me okay and i've had my fair share since i was as young as 15 let me, let me just say as young as 11 that's when i started noticing this particular fungal infection i didn't even know what it was as of then but i know that it was just on one of my finger and it was this one this middle one right here and it ate so deep into this one that it turned dark brown almost black um when i was little i did a lot of washing i did a lot of house chores from washing clothes to cleaning the house to washing toilets to cleaning the bathroom a lot of things but i feel like when i got this because a lot of people used to tell me that it is always in dirty water from dirty water because i know i hardly even go downstairs when i was little i'm always almost in my house in my father's house almost every single time so um as kids you know i um i have four siblings and when we like soak our clothes because of the dirtiness you know too much play and all of that we'll have to leave it so sometimes for some days and sometimes i forget that i'm supposed to actually wash these things i forget that i'm also I'm supposed to wash it maybe in two days or three days but i i leave it to stay longer than that and it starts thinking and i think that's when all this started i don't know sincerely i don't know but from my research they say from contaminated water fungi fungus or whatever is breeding in the contaminated or water and all of that so i think that's where it all started from it wasn't as bad as that it was not so bad when i was like when i was very very small it was just on this finger on this right middle finger that's where it was only then it started progressing and started spreading when i got to the university no when i was even in secondary school that's when it started spreading i wasn't even paying so much attention to it because it just means it will grow but when i got to the university it progressed you guys there's nothing i know use there's nothing i know use i used tea tree oil i used this nizora cream this is the real cream actually helps you know on that open places i'm going to be inserting pictures you guys i used to be very very ashamed i was also ashamed of sharing this but i felt like there must be someone out here that might need this video okay that might need this help so i was using this i'll apply it on my nails and it will grow out you know you apply it has grown out so there's no other place to apply it again you guys i'm telling you guys in less than three two days it starts it just lifts and as my nails are lifting from my nail bed it hurts so bad i can't put my hand inside anything peppery i can't use my hand to eat any peppery thing you know how you're eating pepper nail pepper chicken and all that i can't use like my hand to eat or even to wash pepper and use and cook just know that my hand will, will pain me for the rest of that day until the next day before it actually reduces and it is also active like when whenever it's happening whenever my nails are lifting from my nail bed i can feel it it is so painful you guys so i was using this it actually helps but i will show you guys very very well but you know it didn't work it continued it progressed my whole hand chopped off i'm going to be starting pictures you guys my whole hand i documented the whole journey so i finally went to see a doctor back then in school i went to a doctor the doctor told me that i need to take tabinafine tablets and tabinafine tablet is such a very very strong antifungal drug that actually is meant for this kind of infection to treat it from the inside because i told him i mentioned to the doctor that i've tried everything tea tree oil bobo niche i don't know if you know bobo niche you know how painful it is i put it on my fingers you guys oh my god i used it on my finger it hurt so bad i thought it was going to kill it it did not like i put it and tied it with bandage my pain threshold is so high i can take a lot of pain like i was shocked that i actually did that kind of torture to myself so please don't even don't do it if you have fungal nail infection then i tried um taking this having a fee, but it was so expensive i could not afford it the doctor said that i need to take it for at least three good months before i start seeing progression so i only took one card one like one pack of it and it made it worse because i didn't complete my dosage 
it like it like woke the fungus up the fungus up even stronger than it was so the tin actually now entered my whole nail because there was as at, at that stage it was still there was some nails that are still looking okay and there are others that were completely chopped okay and i was always wearing press on nails if you open my drawer there's my drawer over there you see up to 20 stash of press on nails i'm always covering my nails because i'm not proud of it and whenever i see anybody the first thing i look at is their nails okay so i try to i'm always covering my nails because it was so bad you guys my nails were damaged at the cost of taking this medication i was told that tabinafine i was told that i'm not supposed to take it if i'm pregnant or breastfeeding that is too strong and it is not advisable okay so i just was like okay please i'll go back to this later and you know it got worse when i was then ready to start taking it again i got pregnant with my second child and decided to just just leave it there until i'm done i'm done breastfeeding then i went to a pharmacist near me and i got the tabinafine so this is tabinafine tablets 250 gram and inside here is 28 tablets so it is advised that you need to take this for up to eight weeks or even more depending on how bad your own is i took like this the i took three cards of this this is the fourth one i could not complete it you guys because it was dealing with me i'll have this bad migraine when i say migraine i mean the one that will be punching and tweaking a part of my forehead that it is so painful you guys it was so so painful i called my pharmacist i told him so i don't think i can continue with this he said i should just try i completed the third pack and i was on this one i was like i was like trying to push myself to complete it but boy oh boy boy oh boy it was so so painful and make sure you are eating you just need one card a day make sure that you take this immediately after eating if you have this infection okay make sure you take it immediately after eating and for context this can actually mess up your bacteria the good bacteria in your vagina because when i was taking this i noticed that i got yeast infection my i cheated it for a very long time before it i, I even it, i think it was towards the point the point i stopped taking this that the yeast actually calmed down okay because it is very very strong it is, it is made with very very strong ingredients so if you're taking this you can experience that infection you can experience migraine you can experience a lot of things and just other and make sure that you're not pregnant or breastfeeding if you are going to be taking this card please if you are not sure i need more context on this meet your pharmacist your doctor to make more inquiry okay but this is what i use this is tabinafine tablet and it is for nail infections now the next thing i used that actually helped me so so much is this lamisil one percent um cream 1% gel or be I think one percent yeah it has tabinafine inside it as well so this tabinafine that is inside these products are actually what helps you know heal my nails and I'm so happy you guys now I've, it's almost three months you guys it is almost three good months and this is my nails okay my nails are all grown this is my left and this is my right I think this may do one i don't know what's going on with it okay you guys can see this is the nail it all started with so it's it's a bit very very stubborn but yeah so this is the one it's all started but i'm so happy we've made progress you guys this is what this is my nails at the beginning do you see what i showed you guys at the beginning like it was so bad but i'm so thankful okay i'm so happy and i've not put anything on my nails for almost when i started this journey i tried to stop press on nails i i was still going back to it but at some point i stopped so for almost like five months now i've not done anything on my nails i'm just you know taking my medication another thing that i also took was this hair skin and nail supplements the biotin inside it is also good for the nails so yeah i took this is like my first bottle throughout the course of this i started taking this one early this year be last year and i always buy the ones of 
120 gummies or 80 gummies just so it lasts longer so this is everything i use to heal my nail fungus and abby nail fungal infection and i'm so happy you guys i'm so so happy like this is has this has been my biggest insecurity my biggest like when i go out i'm always hiding my fingers because because I, that's the first thing i notice when i see people so i don't know whether they notice the same thing when they see me as well but either way yeah that's how i cheated it i am so so happy you guys i am so so happy i'm so so thankful so just make sure that if you're going to be taking this number one eat very very well eat drink lots of water drink lots of water expect some minor minor changes i, I even noticed i was always nauseous then the migraine that level of migraine oh my god it was so painful that to the extent that I, even when i take my ibuprofen or um panador it does nothing literally it does nothing to help the situation so just know that this this has and so many other symptoms that you'll be experiencing during during the course of taking the medication as well so yeah then um for context i got this sorry guys i forgot to tell you guys i got this one for this particular pack of tabinafine i got them one just like this now 28 tablets ten thousand naira per card okay per pack like this and i used for this the fourth one i'm just keeping this one just in case <laughs> because i feel like this right hand that everything started with is still so so stubborn but so far so good i can easily i'm so happy i'm fighting the urge to go do my nails i'm fighting the urge I've been browsing nails that will not damage nail types that will not damage my nails like Baya, um, Builder Gel, but I need to go to a professional, people that know how to do these things very, very well so that I don't damage my, my nail any further, but I'm still enjoying how good my nails are looking right now. You guys, you know the last time I saw my nails like this, the last time I saw my nails like this was like jesus up to four years ago or three years ago like completely all grown all together like this man that's so bad anyways yeah so if you're going to take this make sure you eat and yeah drink lots of water and that's it you guys and for this one i got this one for forty thousand. currently it's going for forty thousand. but when i started taking this it was 18k i'd be seventeen thousand. So if you can, even if you want to buy, you can go for the smaller ones that are around, I think around 18,000 as well or 20,000 right now. Those ones I think has 60 gummies or 40 or 80, I can't remember. But yeah, so these are all I used. This is everything I used. Throw away that tea tree oil. If your infection is bad as mine, this is everything you're going to need. If you can't get this Nizora, Nizora is more affordable actually than this Nalamisi. Lamisi was, I think I got Lamisi for 8,000. This tiny thing you're seeing here, 8,000 or 9,000. Yeah, around that same price. But this is everything I use to treat my fungal nail infection. And I hope I'm helping someone out there. Don't worry, it's going to heal. I didn't even know. I was just trying my last luck, you guys. I was actually taking the last leap of faith with this with this particular drawer i said that if if i'm done taking this and it doesn't work i'm done you know i'm going to just accept the nail fungus and just live with it for the rest of my life but i'm so happy that i gave it a try and it actually worked so sometimes when you're treating something on the outside and it's not working try treating from the inside and see if it works yeah and that's all i have for you guys today on this channel and i hope you guys enjoyed watching if you have any further questions please leave it in the comment section and i'm going to be seeing you guys on my next one i'll see you guys thanks for watching bye bye Mwah.